Okay, I got it recording now. Maybe lift that up just a little bit. There we go. Got the smoker smoking with burlap. I think I want it going a little bit stronger. Getting the burlap going. There we go, that's going. Woo! Okay. And Jesus, smoking! Okay. Let's see what we got inside. Roach. This is gonna be right here, and that's where the top box is gonna go. Let's get these fellas worked down, girls. Yeah, in there, you. Definitely a lot easier with the jacket. I don't have to really worry. Makes things a lot quicker. What? It's glued down. Man, is that full. Some high beetles and roaches and things. High beetles are definitely not too bad because this thing is strong. Come on over there. Okay. I don't really like this burlap smoking. It's too light. I like the I like the pine and I like smelling. Boy, it's full of brood. Full of drone brood. And here's what I'm doing is I'm pushing this to the side. And I'm gonna go number it. I'm going to push it to the other side because that's not the way I usually do it. just going to do it the way I usually do it. I'm not going to change things. I go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that's how I mark it on my sheet. This is box 2. And this is box 1. Which... I always get in box two first, just because that's how it works. Man, they got a lot of propolis. Let's see what I got on here. This was full of honey. And, well, you know, it's half full of honey. Some drones. This side's full of honey. It's uncapped. 
It's big drones all over. That big drone right there. That big old drone right there. Alright. And I'll put it up against this side. Did I see any brood? I need to make sure. Let me double check. Quick. This side's awesome. This side's nice. No eggs. I don't ever have a problem with this size. I really did not need to wear a suit with this one. This one, I will need to wear a suit. But I'm just making myself comfortable. Move, guys. I won't kill you. So, honey and pollen in the first frame. We got brood. And we got brood. We got a queen cell with nothing in it. And we got a queen cell with nothing in it. One, two. Okay. So we got honey and brood and brood. Let's go with that. Honey. Brood. Get out of the way, you. Lots of drone brood. Lots of drone brood. Oh, there's some queen cells. Uh oh. That one's capped. That's. Oh yeah, that's. That's a capped queen cell. That's a cap queen cell right there. But it almost looks like drone. I might have to flip these today. Which it's been, the weather's been so bad, doesn't look like they swarmed, but they are about to. If that thing's capped, once they cap it, they, they swarm. There's one full of royal jelly. I'll get this up there and show you all the royal jelly. Look at that. They busted in there. Oh, and there's another one. Busted into that one. Full of brood. There's a queen cell there, but it's full of royal jelly. They may be capping it. 
Let's get a picture of that. So I gotta mark the fifth frame. We got brood. We got brood. And we got a cap queen cell. That one is huge. Where it's capping. They are capping it. And they're capping that and they're capping that. Three. Unless I ripped them open from the bottom side, which could be. Go on to number seven, eight, nine, and ten. There's so many bees. The bad thing is I just put my stuff in the freezer and I don't know if it's healthy enough for them. Okay, no queen, no swarm cells. Just brood. Honey on this side. Honey on this side. No brood here. They are ready to swarm. If it wasn't so windy today, I would almost bet they would swarm. That's honey. That's honey. That's honey. The last two are honey. But just look, just, just look. Pull it out. Honey. Honey. So they aren't going hungry. Okay. Now let's put this cover on. And move it aside. I've done made them mad. But good thing I'm wearing this stuff. Pull up my pants. And they're not even that mad. 